Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the next four issues in the Warhammer 40,000 Conquest subscription from Hachette Partworks. If you don't already know what this subscription is, it's a monthly subscription which will cost you £7.99 a week. So that's roughly £32 every month and they bundle all of these four issues uh, for the month in one bag or box um, and each issue comes with paints, brushes, models, uh, scenery kits. They're in here. This is the next four. Uh, thank you so much for your patience and your interest and all your comments and likes. It really does uh, motivate me to continue with this series. Um, I finished with the Warhammer 40k Legends uh, collection which was a series of 80 Warhammer 40,000 and Horus Heresy novels at a, pr at a cost of £10 per book. So I saw that subscription to its end um, and likewise uh, do the same with this one. So let's unwrap this. Wow, that's sharper than I thought it would be. Um, so, whoa, here we go. 55, 56, 57 and 58, I believe. So let's just put all of these up here. There's 57. And there we go. So these are the issues. Uh, of course, uh, this will be my unwrapping and first look at issue 55 in here. And um, there'll be a separate video for issue 56, which includes a huge flurry of um uh, miniatures. Uh, this is, uh, it says Games Workshop 2017 because this is the same sprue that you get in the Dark Imperium uh, box game, uh, which I think you can still get uh, just in blue plastic. 57 will just be first look and review all in one because you only get two paints and that's pretty poor in my opinion. But 58 uh, has the attack bike in there and it also has, I think, some new game mats. Yeah. Um, so that will be an unboxing and then a, a separate review video. So let's crack on with issue 55. So here it is. Uh, you've got a lovely uh, picture there of the Alchemite pipes. I think that's how you pronounce it. I think I've already got this scenery piece. If you wanted to get it separately, uh, it's actually half of the sprues from the Sector Mechanicus Alchemite stack, which will set you back £30. So that's almost a saving of half price um, because I think you get the other half of this Alchemite stack uh, in another issue at some point. So half price saving is still better than a third party discount. I like the fact that you get a load of scenery in this subscription. I think you get a bit too much scenery if I want to say that, but um, yeah. So this is half of, half of that whole kit. Um, there you go. Uh, so we'll have a look at the sprue in a moment. Quite a large sprue. Let's look at the magazine itself. So 55, starts off with Orcs. Um, you've got Orc Clans, Orcs Showcase. Lovely Stomper there. Uh, it's also worth noting that Morkonaut and, and Gorkonaut, they are the same price now as the Stomper, 75 pounds. I think they used to be 60 and then 65, but they're now the same price, crazy. Anyway, Orcs uh, Showcase, uh, you've got some new models there from, from last year. Successor chapters for Imperial Fists, some more there. Chaos Rising Part 2. Uh, how to build the Alchemite pipes. Very straightforward, you'll have them done quite quickly. The only difficulty really, again, is, is just the mould lines. Um, they will have quite considerable mould lines. Um, how to paint them, they say just paint Lead Belcher on there. Uh, they coloured them blue, the actual container stack. Pretty interesting. Uh, lots of detail that they've put on these um, Alchemite pipes. And then that's what you get. So you don't get that colour, which would have been cool if they showed you how to make them that colour. Uh, but you do make them uh, looking like that. Very, very metallic looking. Uh, new terrain rules. A poison city. And then septic sabotage. So a new little uh, mission there. Uh, and then I look at the next two issues, which is 56 and 57. Unfortunately, it only has uh, two, two paints, but it does go through how to make um, some plasma effects, which is pretty awesome. I like all the versions of plasma. I like the orange, I like the blue, and I like the green. 
which is my favorite, probably say the green actually. Um, although orange works really well for chaos. Uh, so yeah, 56, you've got um, some of the in intercessors from the Dark Imperium set. And then yeah, 57, you got the two paints. Let's have a look at the sprue itself then. So this is the same sprue that you'd get in the uh, half of that Mechanicus um, set for 30 pounds, but it's just in the brown plastic. You can see the big exhaust stacks. You can see the um, chimney, you can see the, the venting and the big uh, manhole cover, I want to call it, uh, with a hinge and some uh, fans in there, and then uh, the pipes that go to the chimney. So yeah, fair bit of detail on there. Um, like I say, it's the mold lines that you probably have an issue with. Um, you know, when you when you glue the chimney itself together, you, you might have a gap, but you know, just got to be careful with the glue in. But that should take you no longer than sort of 20 minutes, half an hour to put together. And then you've got a nice bit, bit of scenery. And um, what I'll do is uh, I'll hurriedly go away and build this and uh, get your review out um, in a separate video. I like to release the review video directly after the first look. And um, so it'll probably be the next video you see. Thank you ever so much for joining me today. Thank you for watching The Emperor Protects.